Hey, what's going on everyone? Back again with another review. Today I have something pretty amazing. I don't think you guys have ever seen a projector like this. This thing has some pretty amazing features. Uh, we have a camera, speaker, and the other cool thing is it can move around. So like, take a look from the app here. I'm able to move it anywhere I want to. And the other cool features, because it has a camera, I can see where it's moving everywhere. And then the other features is uh, auto docking uh, for charging. You don't really need to pick this up because it's a little bit on the heavy side. And when you are ready to project like a movie or anything like that, or this is actually perfect for office as well too, because you're able to set positioning for this too. So let's say you want this to go in a certain room. You're able to set that position from that docking station. It's going to remember where to go. Then you're going to go ahead and click the docking station and we'll go back to the charging itself. So pretty much you're not, uh, you don't really need to do anything. Uh, once uh, you set up the positions, you're all set up. And then we have the manual movements, of course, as well, like you're seeing right now, like when I move it, I can set it up to go anywhere I want. And when I'm ready to project the movie, I can just go ahead and click it and it will uh, set itself up. And uh, let's say you're done. I'm just going to lower it. Now it's going to go back to the docking position here. And uh, pretty much that's it uh, whenever you're done. So taking a look at the back here, we do have the HDMI and USB input as well. But you're able to project like YouTube or anything like that from the app itself. So you don't really need to like use the HDMI or USB. Uh, the only thing I wish this had is like uh, to mirror my phone. That would have been an amazing feature, but uh, fortunately it doesn't have that. So also at the back down here, so if we're going to open this thing, uh, we do have that battery compartment here. And the other cool feature is it has an extra battery compartment as well up here. So you're able to put two batteries uh, if you're going to want to extend the hours so when you're watching a movie or anything like that. So I'm going to go ahead and demo it and see exactly how it's going to work if you were using it. So I have the app open, so I'm just going to rotate it. So I'm going to just project the image from uh, here to the wall. The cool thing is I'm able to see everything uh, where it's moving. So right now let's just put the projector on. Okay, so I'm just gonna move it a little bit to the right. Then we do have the screen and I'm able to move it anywhere I want to because the whole head up there rotates, which is uh, pretty cool. So I'm gonna go out of Keystone as well. So we have the out of Keystone and out of focus now. This is uh, what many projectors lack and this to have the autofocus, it's amazing. I love uh, when projectors like have autofocus because you're always up there trying to focus every time you're playing a movie. So it kind of sucks. So this is like actually really awesome. So I'm just going to go ahead and put a YouTube video here. Okay. So it's pretty much uh, that easy and uh, I have the volume control here as well. So that's some uh, pretty good footage, uh, we're gonna see that after. Okay, let's just turn the volume down and then I'm able to go to the next video and everything. Uh, there could be a little bit of a better app control, uh, probably that's gonna be coming up in the newer updates uh, to access the YouTube easier because right now Pretty much you need to add the playlist and uh, you have to go back to the app again. And this is one of the features which I love about the projector. So you're able to control the projector, move it anywhere you want to. Then you're able to do this. Then you're able to move the head anywhere you want to. And also you can rotate it as well. Um, I don't think any other projector is able to do this. Uh, so this is some pretty amazing thing. Uh, it's definitely worth the price when it comes to this. So the projector, it's uh, 250 lumens, uh, which is not that high. 
but considering everything is a very small factor it still does a really great job as well and then we do have the auto keystone the camera and everything else and the autofocus of course and then uh, the battery life uh, comparing it uh, with the two batteries is going to be around the four hours with the only one battery that's included uh, you're gonna get around that two hour range so which is pretty good I'm very happy I'm able to show you guys cool things like this uh, so go ahead and click that subscribe button to stay up to date for more tech reviews like this also if you enjoyed this uh, video uh, go ahead and click that like button as well any questions you guys might have go ahead and leave a comment below and I'll try my best to answer it as fast as I can I'll see you guys next time